डॉक्टर प्रदीप पानीग्रही जी डॉक्टर प्रदीप पानीग्रही जिन सर इट इज अ रेयर अपॉर्चुनिटी फॉर मी दैट यू हैव गिवन अ परमिशन टू स्पीक इन दिस अगस्त हाउस एंड द हेल्थ बजट प्रेजेंटेड बाय द ऑनरेबल मिनिस्टर हेल्थ सर हेल्थ इज अ वेरी सेंसिटिव सब्जेक्ट a very touchy sensitive and very important subject so the nation's wealth the first wealth of a nation is it considered the health of a nation the greatest wealth also be considered is the health of a nation if health of a nation is a in the highest order the nation's growth progress prosperous lies in the wealth of a nation health of a nation and their basis that since independence the india have seen three health policies and the latest health policy in 2017 under able prime minister sri pap sri jashasp narendra modi ji we have a health policy which covers universal health care accessibility quality health services also health access to the remotest part and all sections of society and that basis in last 10 years we have seen a sea change in health policy and health services across india honorable president sir the health policy which given an ample opportunity to create a good health and good uh, infrastructure across the nation by different budget under last phase 1 14 to 19 19 to 24 and 24 24 uh, second half and third of modi government the budget is increased in consideration from upa 2013 to 12 to 13 14 the 36 crore thousand crore was the last budget by the upa government now the government and uh, under nda government the budget is increased 250% by 91000 crores this shows the intention of the government and the intention of the honorable prime minister health minister and finance minister to have to see the how priority is given to health sector looking the health aspect also sir the 35000 crores under ayushman bharat scheme people are benefited under this scheme 1 lakh 1.5 lakh health and wellness centers throughout india is established for well being of the nation citizens india sir another important scheme is introduced also the senior citizens means 70 above person aged persons are covered under aishman bharat scheme to reduce the family health burden on the families now the sir medical colleges are which have already revealed by our honorable friends and uh, our colleagues that uh, the health institutions particular medical colleges are increased in uh, uh post modi period that continues in 2014 onwards that was right now 731 in comparison comparison to the upa and the pre pre independence post independence period to 3387 and mbps seats is increased to 108 that means the uh, 100 percent above that in uh, mbs it is increased mbbs this means the government intention to how serious about the health issues of the nation in this connection sir though health the union budget of 2024 stands as a beacon of hope and progress in our nation's journey towards a health and a more prosperous future it signifies the unwavering commitment of our government to prioritize the health and welfare of every citizen recognize that health is populous is not just a basic human right 
but a cornerstone to thriving society. Let us delve to the specifics of this transformative budget in a data which I have already revealed. This allocation exemplify the comprehensive approach of addressing the myriad health care challenges in our nations. The focus on increasing health expenditure, bolstering the IUS, IUS and Ayushman Bharat Yojana, and health research implementing health critical initiatives such as Ayushman Bharat Yojana, and Pradhan Mantri Jana Arogya Yojana underscore the government's commitment to enhancing the health care infrastructure and services. Furthermore, the establishment of the health and wellness center this signifies the proactive role of the government. In this connection, sir, uh, there are certain subjects which are already in sub I have support of this budget, and I have such certain uh, experience in as a grassroots politician in the, uh, the ground that I have seen, sir, the terminal ill diseases which the poor people are suffering at the ground is unbearable the cost they cannot afford, sir. I request Honorable Prime Minister is a common man's Prime Minister, Honorable, Honorable Health Minister also a common man who represents the entire mass of the India as a health minister, and Honorable Prime Minister is a finance minister also benevolent to give an ample opportunity in a health budget. Make this, sir, this is a very uh, sensitive issue, sir. I, that's why I'm speaking. I know that the people have the bear cost of the health. Sir, uh, in the state of Orissa, I belong to the state of Orissa, there are two, two things, sir. For uh, the Biju Swastya Kalyana Jojana, they have afforded 5 lakh per a person of a male candidate and 10 lakhs per female candidate. Here it is, sir, for terminal diseases like a kidney failure or heart diseases or um, uh, heart stroke or liver problem, the cost is uh, around above 10 lakh, 20 lakh, 30 lakh, sir. The common man, um, common man is un unable to bear these things. I hope the government will consider this proposal to increase the Aishman uh, Bharat Yojana from five conclude. lakh to ten lakh. Dr. And also, sir, in each constituency, in each constituency, there should be an, one umbrella approach, which is to be considered in uh, in our mind uh, district Ganja. That is that in one umbrella Yojana, everything should be in one umbrella. That is trauma care center. That Sishu Bhavan, that for child care or pediatric care, that is also the, uh, the uh, diseases, preventive diseases, sir. Also, our genetic for older persons, also thalassemia unit. Doctor, also, kindly conclude. Sir, I'm just concluding, sir. This is first of all, sir. That, Health is very that sensitive, is your maiden speech. Already you have ten, more than seven minutes. Ten minutes, sir. Seven minutes. I hope, sir. Please, one minute. One yeah, minute. I, I, have, I, just, I have just one suggestion, sir, for Please. my constituency. You must. Uh, my con constituency consists of two districts, sir, Ganjam and Gajapati. Gajapati is a tribal district, sir. There is no health uh, medical college there. The people of Gajapati have demanded for pretty long years for a medical college at Gajapati. Ganjam, which is the largest population of the Odisha district, sir, have around 42 lakhs people. They don't have a super specialist hospital. Most of people go to either Andhra or Bhubaneswar for health treatment. So I request the ministry consider a super specialist hospital at Ganja, also a medical college at Gajpati. Thank you, sir. I support the budget. Thank you.